Oh my Ah! Oh! oh my god! Bro, I'll tell you now it's done, bro. This country's a wrap. Hey guys, welcome! We're back. Today's video, top 10 ridiculous lies North Korea has told the world. Wow. I'm here with Ethan and Toby. Where's the enthusiasm, bro? Acting like we're not your boys. No, you are my boys. Well, let me know something you guys are, you've lied about. One of the biggest lies you've ever Big told someone. lie. Yeah, I'll give you one. I was like, to this girl, I was like, ah, I got a small penis. <laughs> you fuck off, like, get into the video, fuck off. It's actually, it's actually just like, it's so like eight year old banter, bro. Like, Why is that eight year old? Childish. Bro, like, oh, it's, I told her I had a small penis. Okay, okay, I'm small okay, cock. Okay. No, no, no. I told her I had a small cock. Guess what? The punchline is I don't have a small cock. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking snort after it. Oh my god. <laughs> Fucking you loser, bro. <laughs> Alright, I'm playing the video about this. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's fine. fine. We're looking at absurd pieces of fiction that official or authoritative North Korean sources have claimed as true. Number 10. Kim Jong-il was the greatest at everything. Why is everyone so f***ing stupid? <laughs> Oh, this is the best. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bro, I love that movie so much. It was so funny. Kim Jong-il, North Korea's leader from 1994 until his death in 2011, was amazing at, well, everything. Is he the Donnie that said that he won all the gold medals and that in the Olympics? Uh, yeah, apparently. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Do you know how funny that is? And if you tell him otherwise, bro, it's done, you're dying. Yeah, you're dying. <laughs> Uh, I swear you didn't win it. Bow. <laughs> <laughs> Gone, disappeared. <laughs> if he's the only person left saying it, I mean, it's true. Yeah. According to official biographies, he could walk at just three weeks old and talk at eight. Wow. And that's not all. As a college student, he wrote 1,500 books in three years and composed six <laughs> operas that are apparently, quote, better than any in the history of music. <laughs> Wow, unbelievable. But his most incredible achievement might be scoring 38 under par on his first ever round of ball. <laughs> done. I am 38 done. under par. Yeah, what the fuck is this? It's like Toby saying, yeah, I went football trial, scored 68 goals and assisted 12 as well. You call me Pele? What? <laughs> including 11 holes in one. 11 holes in one. <laughs> and his first ever round of golf. <laughs> okay. 11. Tiger Woods who? Who? There's an there's almost an alternate universe where this did happen, by the way. And we're the idiots. <laughs> and, we, and we're the idiots. <laughs> so is it any surprise that the first time he bowled, he scored a perfect 300? Fuck off. <laughs> Oh my God. In 2015, a manual called Kim Jong-un's Revolutionary Activities was issued to teachers, directing them to instruct <laughs> students that their new supreme leader could drive a car at just three years old. <laughs> Bro, turn what? off the video, man. How? Bro, I'd hate to have grown up in this country. How could he even out. reach the pedals? How could he reach the pedals? This is the thing. It don't make sense, bro. Like, it's pointless. Uh, but then you got people in that country believing that. They have, like I said, bro. They, well, they have no choice, bro. Man, it's what I'm saying, bro. <laughs> if you go against the supreme leader, you're supremely dead. It's done. <laughs> Supremely dead. Kim Jong Il had a strange superpower. Oh come on! Has your stomach ever hurt from holding in gas? Yes, yes. When Kim Jong Il went out on dates, he never had that problem. In fact, according to his official biography, he never pooped or peed. Right. Okay. Brother. Right. This. this what video, is this video? <laughs> it's outrageous, bro. I can't believe the waffle I'm hearing. So then, when he does go to the toilet, like, what's he doing? <laughs> What's going on? No, bro, he don't. No, bro, he, no, bro. You're saying when he does go to it, he don't, bro. He don't no, no, but like, surely someone's seen his penis, like, release liquid. What? It might have come. Who knows? Zhang Il's incredible mind control extended from his bowels to the weather as well, which reputedly changed with his moods. Wow. <laughs> If he's having a good day, it's sunny. Yeah. Super sunny. Yeah. And then if he's having a terrible time, what, thunder and lightning? So what if he's having a great time, but it's still thunder and lightning? Probably, Does he have to be probably, pretending that? Yeah, I was going to say he probably pretends. <laughs> wow, I'm having an awful <laughs> day. <Stop frowning. laughs> God, I can hear it. I can hear someone like in the opposite, above me, banging. What, like, what, like banging? Like, well, I don't know. Well, like, I just hear him banging or like. Doof, doof. This is what I'm saying, like fucking or not fucking. Do I you know mean? they're done now, so they could uh. have been fucking. It was literally just a minute of just constant thuds. It sounds like me, to be honest. But... Wow. <laughs> <laughs> I can relate, brother. North Korea has a wonder drug that makes people taller. For a guy that was five foot three, Kim Jong Il really hated short people. 
Wait, he hates short people. Wait, he was how tall? Five foot three? Yeah, and he's the one hating short people. <laughs> Fuck it. Bruh. Bro, I can just hear thudding. <laughs> what, are they do what are they doing, man? Hey, let's go. Uh, hey, you got a broom right, bro, hit the ceiling, hit the ceiling, hit the ceiling. You got a broom right Start banging yeah, yeah. back. What, just start banging the wall back? Yeah, yeah, yeah do it. Bang, bang the ceiling. Yeah. God's sake. But after you do it, you have to hit it three you know times what? and then shout, hey. We've just, yeah, yeah, we turned him into Karen. Hey, stop banging. <laughs> It's like Morse code. Did you do it? Oh. Oh. Okay. Wait, what uh, happened? No, I just heard a drill. Ah. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm not like great. It's really. a lot less exciting, really. That. Uh. Uh, I thought someone was getting their fucking ending, but. Uh, <laughs> bollocks, though. According to a former tutor, in preparation for the World Festival of Youth and Students in 1989. Kim Jong-il removed disabled residents from the capital and commissioned what? pamphlets advertising a <laughs> cure for shortness. But surprise, it was a trap. Respondents were exiled to uninhabited islands. <laughs> oh my God. Bro, I'll tell you now it's done, bro. This country's a wrap. When she only that guy's over six foot. <laughs> <laughs> oh, mate, do you know how many girls would be gassed to go to North Korea now? <laughs> break the that down, that break that about. down. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. Vic would be screwed. <laughs> Imagine. <laughs> you know how Vic wants to travel everywhere. Oh, bro, it's done. He's getting exiled. <laughs> exiled to it. I'm, I'm you know the roller coaster where they're like, <laughs> oh, you got to be this you tall. Be this tall. <laughs> <laughs> you got to be this tall to enter the country. <laughs> Several defectors allege that the government has established a remote dwarf village for people less than four right. feet tall. Residents are forced to undergo sterilization so they do not pollute the, quote, purity of the race. <laughs> oh! Oh, okay. No, nah, no, nah, this is mad. That's outrageous. No, nah, no. Nah. Bro, mad. he's moving like Hitler. No, nah, he's moving like Hitler now. Number six. Parliamentary elections are democratic. But just how democratic is North Korea? Well, according to the always reliable Korean Central News Agency, <laughs> democracy in the one-party state is thriving. <laughs> one party? <laughs> <laughs> the 2014 parliamentary elections boasted a 99.97 turnout, with 100% of voters approving the candidates chosen for their districts. 100%! Yeah, not one discrepancy. <laughs> Amazing. Amazing. Imagine some other person trying to <laughs> vote for the other party and they just shot dead. Yeah. No. <laughs> Anyone else want to try and vote for that party? <laughs> Outrageous. Oh my god. Of course, there was only one name on each ballot. In North Korean elections, voters can reject <laughs> candidates by crossing their name off with a red pen mm. or by dropping their ballots into a different box. Mm -hmm. All under the watchful eye of government officials. <laughs> Shockingly, not one person Jesus. did. Now wow. that's democracy. Wow. Number five. Wow. North Korea has a cure for AIDS. Oh my god. And bird flu. And mm -hmm. Ebola. Mm -hmm. and tuberculosis and, and COVID? cancer <laughs> cancer <laughs> oh yeah and quote harm from computers that blue light <laughs> <laughs> that blue light bro the drug's ingredients include ginseng grown from fertilizer mixed with rare earth elements and quote micro quantities of gold and platinum say it jj platinum <laughs> platinum <laughs> Kim Jong-il is the inventor of hamburgers. <laughs> I'm not surprised by anything we're seeing anymore. I'm surprised he hasn't said that he can fly. In 2000, Kim Jong-il created a sandwich to provide quality food for university students. Oh, wow. He called guy. it double bread with meat, otherwise known <laughs> as a hamburger. <laughs> double bread with meat, I can't be bothered, man. Go to McDonald's. Yo, can I get a double bread with meat, please? <laughs> And a large potato sticks. <laughs> <laughs> potato sticks. <laughs> we're going to get shot by North Koreans. Yeah, so. we're not making friends here. <laughs> no. I, do I ain't ever going to The thing Korea, is, I don't so think that they won't ever see the video, bro. They've got that internet system, haven't they? Where, like, it's yeah, just... they've got, yeah, 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 they've got their own internet and everything. Yeah. yeah, it's done. But Sidemen don't exist in North Korea, bro. They ain't got a clue about <laughs> us. <laughs> YouTube is blocked in North Korea. It has been pretty blocked since April 2016. Wow. Wow. That's outrageous. That's a lot. Well, we can say now. what we want, boys. Let's go. <laughs> well, I mean, yeah. that's what? That was near the time when I was doing uh, FIFA videos. At least they got to maybe see Lamborghini. <laughs> well, they might have said, that's, that's, if, they have that's been actually, blessed. That is unreal. That's, that's, 
there's somewhere out there there's a 25 26 year old man saying oh back in my day just before the internet was shut off I saw this, I saw this, saw this guy rap about his Lamborghini I didn't, I didn't have a fucking clue what he was saying but good energy number two North Korea discovered a unicorn lair. Oh, fuck oh, off. Come on, man. In 2012, Korean media reported that archaeologists had reconfirmed the existence of a unicorn lair. Charlie! <laughs> Number one. They hate us because they ain't us. The world envies North Korean prosperity. At the general mass games, spectators are treated to a breathtaking spectacle of artistic and athletic performance. This shit's fucking sick. It's quite cool, yeah. With North Korea, do they ever like enter the Olympics and stuff like that? Nah, they make their own, don't they? No, nah, surely, surely they did enter like a World Cup at one point or one no, of the World Cup. That they... Oh, well, I know what you're. T oh, was that North Korea? Remember, remember, they like lied that they won a game. Was there not a thing about players trying to escape and not go back to the country? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not joking. Shouldn't laugh. Well, well, Should well, laugh. They're they the taste of the good life, and they're like, nah, I'm out, I'm out. We shouldn't laugh at any of this, by the way. <laughs> no, no, no. It's it's actually yeah. extremely sad. It's actually mad. No, but it's funny though. You laugh or cry. This point. I hate you. Spectators are treated to a breathtaking spectacle of artistic and athletic performance that reinforces the state's claim that North Korea is a happy, prosperous, and enviable nation. In fact, outside the capital, poverty is extensive and malnutrition is widespread. Regardless, state propaganda also insists that deceased leader Kim Jong il was revered around the world. Right. After all, everyone loves the guy who invented hamburgers. Hmm. What can you have against a man who didn't poop? In reality, Kim Jong-il lived the life of the rich and famous, while hundreds of thousands of his people died of famine. It's so nuts, you know. And wow. North Korea was accused of having one of the worst human rights records in the world. Do you reckon they're walking around this gaff? Yeah, see like they were just walking around on the streets. Do you reckon they're going home to their houses and going, fucking hell, bro, like, I'm being lied to, but if I say anything, I'm just gonna get shot. I actually can't imagine what's going through their heads. They probably don't know any better. Because like, as humans, hu humans know when something's off, yeah? Like, I just, I feel like every human knows, like, ah. Eh probably a myth like yeah but you no, know when something's no, off you because don't. you know what it's like for something to be on so if all you've ever known exactly. is off then it's on it's tapped it's so tapped bro this banging is actually so jarring i yo i can't i can't wait to move out of this place bro where are you gonna move to north korea you trying to go to north korea bro it's jarring man just be grateful you're not in north korea like i am yeah yeah what yeah. what, what? No, you're, 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 Stevie, you're somewhere worse, bro. You're in fucking Stratford. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>